All right, good morning, everybody. Welcome to Let's Go to New York. Uh, I forgot to turn in the rear to frost. That's a shame. Um, because I left the car start for a while this morning. Yay. But um, we are heading to the train station as per usual. So I don't think I ever exactly explained the schedule, and by which I mean I probably explained the schedule about four million times and then forgot. But actually, I don't have to change my morning schedule really at all. We're just leaving a few minutes early just so I have a little bit of extra time to walk around. Because many of you are well aware if you watch the vlogs on a regular basis, Sarah and I leave to go take the 735 Express. The only difference is that I'm going to be taking the 735 Local. And uh, you might be wondering how that's, uh, how that's possible. And really the answer is just that the 735 Local is uh, an outbound train. So that goes to Trenton instead where I'm going to transfer over to New Jersey Transit. Which is how I'm going to get to Trenton. Well. No. To I tell you to get to Trenton. New York because yeah. you're going to be in Trenton. Yeah, I caught it. Don't worry, I caught it. I'm tired, but I caught it. <laughs> and you have a fairly regular work day lined up. Yep. So no excitement for you, but uh, the only thing I have today is the GoPro, which is why I thought the, I thought we left the vlog camera in the car yesterday. I've got to be honest. So I was expecting the vlog camera to be in here, and it wasn't, but we don't have time to go back and get it. So GoPro today it is. Which is fine, because uh, to be honest with you, I probably won't be filming much down there anyway. Because you know what looks really fucking awkward? Somebody, you know what looks really awkward? Somebody filming all these really fancy camera equipment things with a little GoPro. You can get away with it at like PAX and MAGFest. Probably not really going to get away with it at a convention about filming things. For professionals. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go to, well, train station so I can go to train, so I can go to New York. There's a lot of traffic on 95 going, uh, going to New York, ironically. <laughs> Looks like I made a good decision trying to take the train. <laughs> I really hope my coworkers don't get stuck in this. That'd be pretty bad. Goodbye, 724. Not getting on you today.
me tell you, it always feels really, really weird to get off on the side that I usually used to go in. I mean, this is the ramp there, and I walk down every morning, not every night. Heads down, not up. Oh well. I'll meet you guys at home back with a regular vlog camera. Windows update, why? Well, I got a new thing actually. I didn't actually buy anything at the show, but I did buy this. I'll talk about the show in a little bit. But um, this, if you're wondering, is a uh, Kensington Expert mouse, which is a trackball. Woo. Um, yeah, I know I'm shooting this a little bit narrow for this, but I honestly have absolutely no idea where the uh, the 20 or 24 is. It's always good, but yeah, so we've got it. Now, stupid story about this. I bought this from Best Buy. All right, you know, meh, technology company, a lot of other technology companies are better, but it was $20 cheaper on Best Buy than literally everywhere else. By the way, if you're wondering, this is the wireless one. Um, as you can probably tell by the uh, wireless logo there, up in the corner. Um, but, um, where is it? So the one thing that, um, okay, so I got this. And if you'll notice in the corner, it's UPS, right? I got this from Best Buy. And I've been wondering why, for the past couple of days, it's been telling me that they have no tracking information. But the answer is really stupid. It's because they sent me this and then sent the package via FedEx. They gave me tracking information that's accounted to me, but then they also just straight up sent it with another shipping provider, which doesn't make any sense. It literally doesn't make any sense. 